Hey, 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 happy day one of 40 of the Get Up and Go Challenge. Sharon Horn Elstrom here, your hostess or host or whatever you want to call it of the Get Up and Go Challenge. Get Up and Go Challenge is normally a, started out as a 30 day challenge, right? I think I actually started, yeah, I started it out as a 30 day challenge. The whole month of April, we did a 30 day challenge to get up and go, to figure out how to, get a foundational process for dealing with challenges and obstacles and roadblocks and failures and situations that come up in your life that just kind of suck, how to deal with them. <laughs> and we did that in the month of April because many of us were quarantined or living in life situations that had just blown up and were different than anything we had ever anticipated or expected before. And so it gave us a daily little dose of what to do now, how to navigate change, change and challenge. Challenges definitely create change but how do we change on purpose? How do we change so it's right for us? Now, last week, I was challenged with 150,000 other, 150, other entrepreneurs to create our own challenge, mostly for our own personal development and personal growth, but since I love challenges and do challenges all the time, I thought, why not bring you right along with me? If I'm gonna do a 40-day challenge, I knew immediately it was gonna be the Get Up and Go Challenge because I was just finishing up a five-day Get Up and Go Challenge and I thought, huh, I can do a 40 day get up and go challenge. I, I'm not 100% sure. I don't know what I'm gonna talk about every day and what we're gonna do, but I know that I can get massive results for myself in 40 days. And that means I can help you to come right along with me and bring you right along with me during this 40 day challenge. So today, day one, I wanna welcome you and say yes, because guess what? You're probably thinking, I know I was the first time I did a longer challenge. Can I do this? Can I absolutely positively do this? guess what? I'm going to make it super duper simple for you. It's going to be less than 10 minutes a day. So even if heaven forbid you get a couple days behind, you could knock off a couple videos or a few days and catch up just like that. I want to make it <coughs> super feasible. I guarantee there are 10 minutes in your day, whoever you are. I don't care if you are the president of the United States. I don't care if you are a, an astronaut. Everyone on this planet can find 10 minutes or less a day to focus on you, to make your life what you want it to be, to get the results that you want, to get more results in days, in however many days the challenge is, than you thought you could get in years. I've actually, I love things like the four hour work week and the, uh, the, 12, the 12 week year. I love books when they come out like that because they help more people to believe that those type things are possible. I did the four hour work week in a, food manufacturing business, not in an online business, long before Tim Ferriss ever wrote the book, right? So I know that it's possible. But when he brought the book out, less people, and, and wrote the book, less people thought I was crazy for how I structured and ran my business because now there was validity and there was other proof, there was social proof that not only was I doing it, but guess what? Tim Ferriss was, was teaching millions, I'm sure millions of people have read that book by now, how to do it as well. So <clears throat> the same thing is true of challenges. Challenges are like the 12 week year. Challenges are like the four hour work week in that we compress time and we get results, more results in a compressed area, period of time than most people will get in, in, in literally years. <clears throat> and so do you wanna do that? Do you wanna do that for your life? Is there an area of your life that you want a result in and you don't wanna wait years to get it you want it in 40 days you want it in a month you can have that by joining this challenge so today i just want you to think about and our action item for today because we're going to keep it short is to think about what do you want i know that it might not sound like a big thing but chances are the vast majority of people i know me included i think i know what i want but unless i consciously sit down and really ask myself well what do i want in this area of my life what do i want in my relationships what do I want in my physical health and well-being? Well, how much energy do I want? What do I want in my business? How do I want my business to change as the world around me is changing? Literally, um, literally shutting down, changing, opening up, burning, you name it, the world is in upheaval. But guess what? Our world is always changing in chaos, right? It's how do we manage that change? What do I want with my business? What do I want with my finances? What do I want with my, my home and my environment? What do I want with my mental, physical, and spiritual my in my mindset my, my feelings my thoughts my emotions my my way of being and showing up in the world my contribution what do I want in any area of the, my life 
So I want you today to think about what do you want? What is the number one thing you want right now? Really, really want. You personally, not what you think you should want, not what you think your significant other wants or should thinks you should want, not what your mom or your dad or your cousins or your aunts or your friends or your uncles think you should want. What do you, you want? Absolutely only you. And what is it? And it's, it's private to you. And that's what I want you to think of today. And if you're brave, be brave, please be brave. And you want our help and support in achieving that over the next 40 days, or at least making a massive gain toward that thing that you want, share it in the comments below today. That's all you need to do. That's our action item today. Think about what you want and share it in the comments below. And tomorrow we're going to dive in deeply to how you make that a reality, how you really make it a reality, not, not the how you dress it up and fluff it up marketing way of making it a reality. How do you freaking really do it, right? Cut through all the crap, cut through all the BS. How do you really make things happen in your life? That's what we're going to talk about in this 40 day challenge. And that's what you're going to do. That's what I'm going to do is absolutely positively make things happen. And I will, of course, be with you tomorrow. If I can help you in any way, if you have any questions, we're going to show up every day, 11 a.m. live for the next 40 days. I may or may not have my, my granddaughter with me. I'm hanging out with my granddaughter five days a week, so in 40 days, chances are her beautiful little head will sneak at least the top of her head in to one of my videos over that time period. That's, that's my life. That's one of my amazing, delightful challenges that I get to experience every single day. Um, during the changes in the, and the, the shakeups in the world. So I'm just giving you a heads up. You might, you might get to meet her, you might not. We'll see. I try to keep her out of it, but sometimes 11 a.m. she needs my attention. That's just the way it happens to me. That's the way life is. So have an amazing day and get excited because I am super excited to go on this journey, not by myself, but with you. All right, see you tomorrow.